Much of central Cologne has been plunged into darkness within the last hour as part of a protest against a planned anti-Islam march. Lights were switched off at Cologne's great cathedral and on all the bridges across the Rhine as thousands of people joined in the counter-demonstrations. They were protesting at a planned rally by a group calling itself Patriotic Europeans against the Islamization of the West. Let's talk to our correspondent Damien McGuinness, who's in Berlin. Now, Damien, just uh, round up what's been happening. Well, what's interesting is in Cologne and here in Berlin, what we've seen is a couple of thousand people in each in each city protesting against these anti-Islam marches, compared to just a couple of hundred people in each of the anti-Islam marches themselves. That's a very different situation to in Dresden, which is the homeland of this movement. There, we have exactly the opposite situation. There is an estimated 10,000 people who have come, to the, come out onto the streets to protest against what they say or what they perceive as the so-called Islamization of the West. Uh, against them have about, about a couple of hundred people have come out to the streets to protest against what they say is racism because a lot of people here in Germany view these anti-Islam protests as uh, basically racist and intolerant and that's exactly what political leaders, church leaders and high, top politicians including Chancellor Angela Merkel have, have all come out and said. So it's a very controversial movement and what we've seen now in Berlin and Cologne is the reaction of people against that.